What's up everybody? Sean Prefera with Mac Papers here and I'm hanging out the Mac Papers Idea Center in Orlando, Florida and we are looking to print some stuff here today for an upcoming trade show in Atlanta. So I thought I'd take the moment to just show you what I'm doing. Maybe learn a few things about what we have to offer here at the Idea Center and one of those things is printing on some rigid material. Four foot by eight foot. I'm standing in front of our fluid color R84F Turbo. This is a UV flatbed printer. Uh, it is capable on printing object, on objects up to four inches thick. So I thought I'd kind of run through a quick setup, one, two, three, and how quick we can get from zero to print. First thing we're gonna do here is throw our board on top of the table. I'm using a 3 16 3 inch foam core. Um, we have a pin registration system. The flip of a lever, we can justify our substrate into the front zero zero corner so that we have perfect registration every time. I'm going to unlock my pins here and we always got to prep our board. So using a 409, we can easily prep our board from any dirt and debris as well as kill any static to eliminate any type of overspray issues. Again, I'm going to re-register my board. Front, lower left. And then from here, we have a four-zone vacuum. This controls four quadrants of the flatbed table. We turned on all zones since we are covering the majority of the table so that we have good suction to suck this board flat so we don't have any high spots or rip irregularities across the top to uh, avoid any type of head striking or rubbing. So from there, we would simply turn on our vacuum, which is going to be very loud, so I won't do that just yet. But from here, we're ready to print. Alrighty, we have successfully completed our 4x8 print. I'm going to go ahead and move the gantry out of the way so we can see the finished result here. In addition to the suction with the, the, uh, the vacuum blower that's on here, this also acts as a reverse blower. So if we do have a heavy substrate on the table, we can actually enable this and with the flip of this lever here, turn it basically into an air hockey table so we can float this board right off without any issues. So you can look here. Some cool little Cinco de Mayo owls that will be cut out by one of our partners at Multicam at the event. So a little co-branding there going on. I hope that you guys enjoyed the, the short demo here. Uh, look for a whole lot more that we'll be doing here at the Idea Center, if you guys have any questions, feel free to give us a call at 844-MAC-WIDE. Thank you.